Good afternoon. On today's video, I'm out ploughing. I've just stopped for a bit of lunch, so now we're on against day two of ploughing. So yesterday didn't go to plan. Ended up broke a tie rod on the plough. Let's shut them off for minute. Yeah, yesterday broke a tie rod on the plough. I'll put some pictures in of that. Spares. So I, uh, now in the last field I've ploughed two other fields, I've got a block of 17 acres here to plough, three fields which I've had done put on their old, well last year's um, maize crop, so we're ploughing that in. I, could be going for maize again this year, I don't really know at the moment. This is for somebody else anyway, so we're contracting today. If you enjoy my videos, please hit the subscribe button and give it a thumbs up. edge isn't square and straight so I'm just putting a using the rear of the plough and just putting a mark in then just so I can see when I come to plough it I got plough to that line and then um, when I come to plough the ditches then it's right then so I say it's I got the same all the way around I plough to the same spot I'm just holding on the hydraulics just using the back furrow with the full furrow we got going along following a line We got it's not too bad because I got a maze run here anyway, which I'm using as a line, so make life a little bit easier. Just saying, yeah, about well, this one ditch, I'll show you in a minute what I've done when I get to the end. I've done it in all the other fields that top and bottom headland I'm bothered with because I'm just plowing to the hedge so I'll 
show you what I've just done. Oh. Now what I've done, you look here, I've just marked it here all the way down through so I'm, when I'm plowing then I plow up to it sorts itself out easier then so this ed this headland here I haven't bothered with because I'm just plowing to the edge so it's easy enough now I'll just take all this one out at the moment I'm running if you see our uh, 5713S 130 horsepower Dyna 4 with our um, Vernon EM85 plow on the back. I've just ploughed the top ditch, so that's all done now. Now I'm going to plough this ditch here, the one where I put the line up through. So if you can see down through, it's all ploughed to roughly the same all the way down. So I, the line was in here somewhere. So I know that everything is from the line this side is all ploughed. So I'm now going to plough the ditch out. So yeah, when I come up through, I know when I'm passing through here, we've, I know I'm plowing everything that's been ploughed if I'm ploughing into my plough work, if that makes sense. So yeah, we'll just do this ditch a minute and then I'll show you after when it's all done. So yeah. Yeah, we'll just get this ditch ploughed a minute and then um, I'll show you after then. If we look at what I've just ploughed, ploughed one, two, three, and this is line, the line was in here somewhere, so yeah, I've covered everything and a bit more, so yeah, that's why I've just come down through the last one. This one here, I've got gone down twice, or gone up, down and up, I've got twice more on this side, and then that one's done then, and then just a little tiny bit down the bottom. You probably can't see on the camera, just from the, from the gate to gate. Piece, 20 meters long. So that's it for today's video. If you like, if you like it, then please hit the subscribe button to the channel and hit the thumbs up as well. That'd be ideal. Thank you, and I'll see you on the next one. Goodbye for now.